It's Anthony Gordon. Oh, it was gorgeous, and it was very nearly the opener for England. Congratulations going the way of Simon Simone for the splendid save to keep it at nil-nil. Well, I actually felt that this was going to nestle. It was a super well-conducted free kick. Looked like it was going into that far corner. England on top early on. Livramento. Madueke. Again getting clear. What's the cross like this time? It's a better one. And it was very nearly an own goal to give England the lead. Well, excellent. Particularly when he gets 1v1. And then it's a super ball whipped in. Kalahai just gets enough. Here's Gordon. And uh, touched off for the run of Balogun. Keeper deals with it in the end. Gordon has gone for it. And uh, Simone, who was uh, very safe with his uh, work earlier to deny Gordon's free kick, had a nervy moment or two there. The 17-year-old who is between the sticks for Albania this evening. He picked up his first under-21 cap since uh, October on Friday, and here he is again looking to try and pick up a goal. Gordon did well. Madueke. Livramento. Madueke again. That's a handy cross, and it'll be a corner. Could have been more for England. Yeah, it was a real good opportunity for England to go and capitalise and stick that ball in the back of the net. I think it's picking the times, and that's what they've done. And that's why it's given them that little bit of success. Success for Gibbs White in winning possession there. Balogun could be in. Great goal. England finally find a way through, and it's Flo Balogun who has done the business for England right at the start of the second half. Just what the doctor ordered for Lee Carsley. The pressure pays off. Albania nil, England won. Well, we touched on cutting edge. That had everything amongst it. Brilliant play into the forward area. And I tell you what, it's a brilliant finish. They are looking for offside. There's no chance. It's a brilliant. Brilliant, well-executed goal. Good pressure here from Jones, and England could be in again. It's Jones, it's two. And England now have clear daylight between themselves and Albania. It took a while, but they are stretching clear now, and they are closing the gap on the Czech Republic and keeping their qualification hopes well within their own hands. Curtis Jones with the latest goal, Albania nil, England two. Well, there's times to play out, and yes, you want to keep hold of the ball, and that's what they were trying to do, but I love the high press here, and then finds himself 1v1. That's what you get from high press, and then the composure, well, it's first class. England just need to ensure that they don't lose concentration because they have got this game firmly in their grasp. And a deflected hit forces the first save of the game for Joseph Bursic. Well, it was a difficult one, wasn't it? Just deflected off James Garner, who went to go and engage and stop the shot that was going towards goal. That's what made it a little bit difficult for Bursic. Just made sure that it wasn't going near goal. Just parries it wide. Again, some of these young boys that are coming onto the scene, going out to championship football clubs and really learning their trade. Starting to get witness that they can go and perform at high levels. Flick through here for Balogun. There's another, and that will do it for England. Florin Balogun at the double. And England have the three points in the bag now. Flo Balogun, who has not needed much of a sighter to find the back of the net, has produced two predatory finishes to put England firmly in charge of this game now. Albania nil, England three. Well, the ball from Morgan gives why is absolutely exquisite. And you just see the movement from Balogun. That's where he's at danger. And that's why he's got two goals. And that's the important message that Lee Carsley is trying to get over to his side. Gordon chasing this one. Is there a final flourish for England? Gordon, beautifully done. Oh, Gordon, it's wonderful. And it was nearly a magnificent fourth goal for England. 
And the hit is brilliantly saved by Persic, who keeps England's clean sheet intact for now. Well, hasn't had much to do, but has produced two very smart pieces of work, the last of which could well mean the clean sheet. It's a double then from Fuller in Balogun and a strike from Curtis Jones giving England a comfortable success in the end. Full-time then, Albania nil, England three.